Hello everyone, this is Dr. and we're here, and today we are playing, once again, Demon Crow. And someone just completed the quest over here, but you can tell that I actually have my audio fixed. And obviously I have a new character, which I actually look like a lot better than the last one I had. And also I have the golden katana instead of my green. And if you look into the bottom left, yeah, bottom left, you see I have 5,000 run, which is, you know, enough to get the breathing style. I'm already at level 12, and all I did was go over here, which, you know, I'll show you. And, you know, I'm going to just cut, uh, I'll just cut to the part where I'm actually there, so we'll see you there. So right over here, actually, I'm going to go over here first so I can... See if I can do anything with him. I can do yes, yes, this is good. Okay. Dot dot dot. Let me just do that. So right over here, I don't even have to climb up here, but there is this place right over here, which this is exactly where I got all the win I needed. So right over here. And she's saying, oh my god. I lost the the diamond part of my bracelet. Can you help me find it? And if you just click sure right here, I'm not sure what the level requirement is. It's at least, or at most, level 12. You know, more than level 12. And right over here, you know, you go down here, and here's a, the diamond. But you can also find it in two other locations. So after, if it's not over there, I can just climb up here. And it's one all the way here. And it got also be right here. And another place that people are scared me. Another place it could be is right behind the, well not really right behind, but at the building next to the green spawn point or in the place in the mobob. There is the uh, diamond can spawn right over here. And you get five hundred one each time you do do that. And if you are wondering, I already know exactly. And yes, exactly where the water trainer is. The Uru, the, uh, I cannot pronounce the name. From the water former Hashira, Uru Kodaki. That's his name. There you go. So you see that a beautiful waterfall right over there. That he unfortunately scaled last video because I thought, you know, <clears throat> he wasn't playing over there, but it's no, it all over there. And right over here, you may be saying, oh, you can't go behind this waterfall. It's impossible. Or, how about right here? No, it's impossible. Well, there's a cave over here. Big cave, first of all. And there we go. You don't even have to search for it at all. And right over here, is Urokudaki, which is, yep, Sato, Satonji Urokudaki. Sorry if I'm butchering his name, Trapton. It's kind of a hard name to pronounce. You traveled great lengths to see me. I assume the only reason you're here is to learn water breathing. Yes. I am. It will cost you 5,000 when I am willing to do it. You will train under one condition, by cutting the boulder outside my hideouts. Only then you will be suited to actually do this. So, you know, we just run over here out of his hideout, even though it's not really hidden. It is. Um, <laughs> so let me just sprint over here. And right over here, you see these rocks. And you can just swim across the river over here. I believe I just, yep, go right here. And I have to click these little dots. Oh, things on three down. Oh, okay, yeah. Let's see if I go to a different rock, will it work? Ah, oh, crap, I think I failed. Well, I'll see you whenever I'm actually still. There we go, now I have it. And obviously I am on, oh, that was easy, um, 
Now we have to go back to Urokuzaki. <laughs> Oh, sorry, I got scared for a second. Um, so we just have to go over here, and if you actually look in the bottom right corner of my screen, you can see uh, my score is actually up to level 17, which is actually really good. First one that that looks here. Um, first one that hasn't been playing too often. Also, one that was on. Um, and if you do not believe me, I just have to go right here. And these are demon horns. Once I I put one way over there, and then I put one right over here. So they're looking almost everywhere. Not really, you know, everywhere. They're just lurking places. Anyways, let me stop. Um, you surprised me. I did not expect you can cut that boulder on your current state. A deal's a deal. I'll teach you my technique. Since you need to grasp the flow of water, I need you to fetch me blue lowy rocks. Where? Right over here. Right outside of this cave. Literally, again. Instead of the rocks, you know that river though. Okay, I just grew. I just grew. Um, I just went to the move. So right over here, there should be uh, some glowy rocks. If I can find some. You can't really see into the water, so that's where... Oh, right here. Boom. Take one of those. You have to watch out for your oxygen as well. Let me start going up. Okay, I can breathe again. I don't know how I can breathe. This works. Um, hmm. Oh, there's another one. So this is just a really quick and easy um, little mini game. We go up before. Ooh, I almost died. So I'm gonna just you know fast forward while I do this and I'm, as I just tread water. So yeah, I'll just see you in a second. So here's the last of the stones, and I believe the only other things I have to do is, um, what do you call it, defeat his trainee, King Sabuto. If you don't know the anime, then I will not spoil it. Um, it actually might spoil it a little bit. Um, if you do, I'll actually read it fast enough or something you know you know how it is if you read it at all and just walk don't and you just anyways um i'm gonna just go right over to urokodaki and oh wait oh yeah not to pull the boulder now okay i'll do it sir i'll do it just so i can learn water breathing so i could be like the main character you know how it is i got the lot armor on me you know i do not die you don't you don't talk about last video it was because i had a different character on i am like um Yorishi and his brother i do not remember his name unfortunately um it's somewhat annoying thing hello there hello um one thing that's somewhat annoying is just constantly running back so i'm gonna just speed up the video until i get there and yeah. So now we're here, and there's three of these rocks. I'm gonna just choose this one, because why not? And you see that little red arrow? Yeah, I just have to pull the rock over there. I like how it jumps with me. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, just keep pulling it. Keep on pulling it. Keep, keep on pulling it. No. Okay, um, I'm gonna just, you know, skip, oh, never mind then. Well, I'm gonna skip whenever I'm at Orokudaki. So, yeah, I'll just you know, see you there, I guess. Oh, wait, okay. Made a mistake, um. Wait, is there another entrance? I'm wondering where it is. I kind of doubt it, but I believe, yep, there is now, this is the last step. Wait, no. La la one of the last steps. Okay. I have to... I think... Go to the Butterfly Mansion. Which... <laughs> very far away since... I haven't unlocked it yet. I've never gone there. So I'm uh... You know, skip until I'm there instead of... Fast forwarding it. Because that can hurt your ears. Whenever I was um, listening to my... Other video and I sped it up. It kind of hurt my ears. So I'll just um... Skip until I... You know, get there. Now we're at the Butterfly Mansion, and hopefully there's a fast travel person. 
Yep, right over there. Nice. So I can go to, um, I forget exactly where it is. Um, but there is places, there is this person. Okay, well, I do not want to be like, trying to attack anyone right now. Uh, there's a lot of demons there. Just, you know, not too good. Stone pillar and pink pillar. Oh, is there a water pillar? No water pillar? No water pillar? That sucks. Um, so I can set my spawn over here instead of, you know, being where I was training at. But I need to do meditation. Oh, I kind of don't like this mini game, but I think it's a little bit easier than last time. So I'll just speed up the video until I'm done. Oh, yes! Last thing! Woo! That was annoying. Holy crap, yo. I'm not going to tap on Shinobu. Oh, that sucked, yo. So, all we have to do is run right over to the fast travel person. You know, probably just fast travel through everywhere until I get close enough. Um. Uh, I think it's you. I think both of the villagers are, you know, closer than. Oh, I guess not. Huh, there, there was a fast travel person. I was pretty close to him. Um. <laughs> oh crap! But actually, we haven't really done anything. Bandit Zuko. Touch me, okay. Never mind, you can touch me. Oh, this is the worst. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, we didn't talk about that, you know? I, it's the about here and the now, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's 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 what it's about. Anyways, I'll just meet you right back at Urokudaki's cave. Again, we are back at Urokudaki's cave I for I believe one of the last missions before I actually obtain the breathing style of water breathing. It seems you understood how consecrate how to consecrate on your breathing. Now let's put if let's put what you have learned to the test. For your final test, you must defeat Sabito. Yeah, Sabito. Sheesh, I'm gonna get this really long time. I'm gonna try it um, a few times before. Um, there we go. Um, I'm gonna you know play it really safe for the first. first like, I'm gonna be, you know also show you the first time I actually. Him, you know, it can be kind of annoying and tedious. Either way, I'm gonna just run over to Sabuto right over here, and I'll see you whenever I get there.
Yes. Yes, we did it. We did it. Yes. Now we got water breathing. Let's go, yo. Holy crap. That was hard even though it wasn't, you know, we weren't even doing anything. Oh. I was having heart attacks each moment I was getting attacked. Put away my sword so I could get rid of that huge UI. Breathe. Oh, I can't stand still and breathe? That doesn't make sense. And it goes down pretty fast. Okay. Where is oh crap? Water surface splash! No! Water surface splash! Come on, y'all. Oh, that's so right, so. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Breathe. Come on, keep breathing. Water surface splash! No! He's going to beat me up. What a surface flash! Come on, yo! This is gonna get me annoyed. You gotta keep on running away and breathing and running away and breathing. Breathe. No! Come on, yo! He is getting me annoyed. Block. I don't even know where I am. Bro, calm down! Calm down! It's not that. Anyways, I got water breathing. <laughs> And that was the whole goal of the video. Hope you enjoyed it. I'm going to try to defeat at least one person before I get obliterated. So let me... This is going to take some getting used to. Uh, I need to go to... Actually, I test it on you. I hate that I can't move whenever I breathe. You, like, you see my, like, my thing moving around. I cannot move. <laughs> Ooh, how much damage did that do? You good? Okay, you good. You good, you good. That did not sound good. Um, wherever that noise was, that did not sound good at all. Anyways, um, I have to keep on breathing. Okay, that doesn't really do much for me. Um, I'm gonna go back to the starting village. Just by fast teleporting. Uh, you. There we go. Now, ooh, blue spider. Really nice. That's my fifth one. Now I'm gonna just showcase it off a little bit, not too much, because I can't really do much. Breathe. Ah. Yo, dude's beating me up. But yeah, where is he? There we go. Oh, there we go. Beat him up, breathe, run, run, come on yo, breathe, Let's get out of this place. anyways, my water mastery went up to go to bed, I'm uh, you know, continue grinding off, off um, camera, but anyways, we have mastered, we have started to be a water breather user, and I will see you whenever the next video will be. Adios.